and the Delta State Government, Nigerian National Petroleum Company Limited, and the UTM Offshore Limited. Tuesday signed a shareholders agreement for the development of best floating liquefied natural gas, FLNG, in Nigeria. Secretary to the State Government, Dr. Kingsley Amo, and the Solicitor General and Permanent Secretary, Ministry of Justice, Mr. Omar Muzo Erebe, signed for the Delta State Government, while the Group Chief Executive Officer, Mr. Melike Ari, and Group Managing Director, Julius Rohn, signed for NNPC Limited and UTM Offshore, respectively. In the real value. And our partners, and Victor and <laughs> my friends, my brothers, we come a long way uh, working together to create value in our country through legislation and through collaboration. And I'm happy to receive them today. And welcome. Of course, the, the rest is uh, anything but our partners. Uh, if, uh, I like the persistence of uh, Julius. You know. You know, I've never seen this level of persistence in, in business people starting something new, something different. And this clearly fits into the objectives of government under the Decade of Gas initiative and also Mr. President's clear agenda to create hope in the oil and gas industry so that value can be created and we believe this will work. And that's why we're talking to you. Otherwise, Excellency, thank you very much. Let me take more of your, not take more of your time. Uh, me and our co my colleagues, we are committed to this. Uh, we will deliver on this on time and on schedule and on course and the best possible course that we can achieve. Today marks uh, a regard milestone in development of this project with the signing of the shareholders agreement. The Delta State government decided to take 8% uh, equity because of our conviction of the strategic importance of this project to the national economy, but it's very key to our economy, you know. It's expected that over 300,000 metric tons of LPG cooking gas will be produced and dedicated to the domestic market. This project will also help to mitigate the environmental hazards in the Niger Delta by reducing gas flaring from kerosene and uh, firewood to cleaner energy, towards improving their health and general well-being. Another benefit we envisage with this project is that it will create job opportunity for our youth, which is one of our four pillars of our more agenda. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.